no longer a joke. Yeah, it is no longer a joke. Two, people who are fans of Pastor Jerry Eze. The man that put out this slogan, what God cannot do does not exist. Pastor Jerry Eze. Ever since Jule Duce came up with this idea of having a ministry, saying that God called him and that uh, whoever it is out there who thinks that being a movie director, actor, means that God cannot call him, means that he cannot do the will of God or respond to the yearning of his inner man, then they are mistaken. He said he has not left the screen, meaning he will still be putting out movies, maybe Christian movies, maybe Christocentric movies, you know, something like that. He said he will. And because a lot of people challenged him, a lot of people tried to ridicule him, he felt angry, he got angry. And one of those that he decided to lash out at is Pastor Jerry Eze. He dead Jerry is. They said, who is Jerry is? What are you? When did you come to limelight? Is it not social media that bursted and put you where you are? Are you not part of those Corona lockdown made famous pastors? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? What, what do you think? The reason is because many people who are spiritual sons you know that's the start that's a, that's the pattern they have this system spiritual son spiritual daughter spiritual father spiritual grandfather spiritual great grandfather you know they have all of that so many of them came at him some are speaking for him while some are speaking against so yole doche lashed out he said who is jerry Eze? which anointing do you people have if you guys can really heal the sick, I will take you to hospitals. I will take you to where people have cancer. Pray and let us see. Not this. He kept on, on and on saying that he has the call inside of him, roaming around him, and that he's ready to deliver. He said, Pastor Jerry Eze is not doing anything special. That he himself can sit in front of the camera, have some security protocol, ushers, choir, choristers all around him, singing, everyone doing their own beat, that he was going to pile thousands of prayer requests in front of him and he's going to lay on it and begin to sweat and begin to command and begin to, you know, he said he's going to do all of those things. That he's going to call fire to tear and burn every strange problems right in front of him. That he's going to speak and say things in tongues. He said he's going to say every of this. He said, so what is this thing? Why can't he do it? And uh, people were quick to respond to him. They said, look, there's a difference between uh, God called you and you called yourself. Whatever it is that happens along the way, if God called you, you will remind God of that covenant and of that call. But if you Call yourself, when problems begin, you have nowhere to go. You have no one to call. You have nobody to remind. This is number one. Number two, Jerry Eze is not on social media to cash out. He said this is not true, that all of them are cashing out, that if they want, all of them should not take tithe. They shouldn't take nothing. That they should not. That they are cashing out on social media. That they are cashing out. And people asked him, is that the reason why you decided to do this? He said, no. I am responding to you guys on your allegation. Saying that I, I, I have the call of God on me. And that I can do all things through, I don't know what is inside of him, but he said what strengthens him is inside of him. That he's ready to do everything that people should not ridicule him. And I will not lie, there are some pastors, at least we know one or two, that came on social media saying, how dare people say Yule Duche does not have the call of God? Do you know maybe the journey of his life 
and the way he acted and the reason why he is still online today. Oh, you see, do you know why all of these things are happening? That the ways of God are not the ways of men. That we think we know, but we know in part that we don't know everything. And people said, okay, where is it written that you jump from this woman? And they said, stop that. All have seen and come short of the glory of God. How dare you people say, you let Duchi, ah, don't you see? And you let Duchi respond and say, look at some of them that have multiple girlfriends hidden here and there. Their wives do not know. Yet, they are pointing at me that came out publicly. They are pointing at me. But they kept their own sin hidden. And they don't know what the Bible said. That he or she that hides his or her sin. <laughs> so he started giving it back to back to them. That whoever hides his or her sin will not prosper. That he came out to say this is what you are. Moreover, he has not committed sin. That if he has committed sin, how then was did, 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 did God say, David is a man after his own heart. That what makes people think polygamy is a sin. That people have been brainwashed with this European manipulation. That our culture and the culture of the Jews, the children of Israel, that he is one of. That they are permitted to marry as much as they want. That David had more than one. And it is a practice, it is a way of life. If you can, you should. If you don't, move on. That it is not like you have to. That if you don't, you die and go to hell. He said, no, 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 no. It is about choice. And there is nothing wrong that women are made for a man. That there is no big deal about it. That look at those in the Bible. Look at those in the scripture. Look at those in the Bible. Moses had more than one. He said a lot of this here and there that what makes people think polygamy is a sin because you have been brainwashed to think so. That some of those Europeans who came with this idea, selling it to, to us here as if we all are polygamous. There are people who are monogamous. They are not polygamous. There are some in Africa. And those people who sold this idea, he says some of them, many of them, they have multiple partners, mistresses, that are they not the ones who are the creator, you know, like they, they, they came about these mistresses. Like you see a man, he has his wife, beautiful home in the suburb or a beautiful home, you know, like, you know, something like that. And he's enjoying himself, beautiful house, garden, they have a dog, you know, the, 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 the Euro, Eurocentric appearance, you know, that image. They have a, a dog, they, they have a garden in front of their house, they have their driveway, they have the garage, if possible. You know, they have two or three cars, let's say two cars, family looking nice, wife looking prim, everyone is healthy, managing themselves. But this man! He has his mistress or mistresses. He has, he, has, he has some condos. You know, he has some love nest here and there that they take this, that they, that they go to do what they do and they do terrible things. So what is the big thing? What is it that he has nothing to do with these things? That he came out publicly, this is how I want to roll. That out there are people looking at him saying that he's a sinner. That if David was here now preaching, like any of the geos with his numerous wives, would anyone have said, oh, you, 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 you are a sinner. You're, you're a bad person. Then why don't you call David a bad man? Call David a sinner. Call all of them sinners. Do not separate some and say the God of Isaac, David, and you are looking down on him. These are all what he said. Challenging Pastor Jerry Eze. Say, what, what is Jerry Eze doing? Well, what is he doing? Is it that to sweat or on, on, on prayer requests? Sweat, sweat, sweat. Is that, is that the whole thing? Is that all? Who cannot sweat? Who cannot speak? And say words. That if he goes to bring 10 blind people and put in front of, you know, or any of these people that nobody should tell him that he is not called. That he's called and he's going to do what he's called to do. 
I don't know what you guys want to tell Yole Duchi on this. Drop it in the comment section.